<laughs> it was pretty clear. We have had the four play upstairs. <laughs> Second one. You cannot see the details, the pitfalls, the perils, nor the splendors of any landscape from the perspective of some thousand feet above. To really know the landscape, or rather all the landscapes of human diversity, you must have been there, underground, together with those who live in the territory. One time is not enough, nor two. In order to be reasonably familiar with the more unusual landscapes of human life, you must have walked here over and over again. Still, you must always realize that at any time, a new aspect, a new perception of self, a new way to be erotically aroused may be disclosed to you. Disclosure of those which is unusually, unusual, especially when it concerns sex and, and gender, takes a deeper and more trustful alliance than anything we may encounter as fellow human beings and in this context as therapists. Stories like these are clients' gifts to therapists who are proven worthy of deep confidence. We are diverse. We perceive ourselves in different ways as gender, as biologically sexed with genitals, and with brains telling other stories than the so-called sex organs, as with ways to express our love, and as with ways to reach the realms of personal erotic heavens. Hardly any major health education anywhere takes into account this vast and colourful human wealth. On the contrary, the system heteronormative thinking has ruled the waves and left too many with broken hearts, broken spirits, with shame and reinforced traumas or retention. Many have lived and many still live in a constant state of shy alertness, fearing the different kinds of judgments thrown upon them with words like sick, disordered, sinful, or non-existent. To retain wishes and needs of such profound importance is harmful to any human being. It is a great and very timely <coughs> challenge for all who claim to be therapists to have some hundred humility walks in the world of sex and gender erotics. Those who have not done so should declare, declare themselves not eligible to work with clients equipped with talents of the kind this book describes. My first encounter with anyone, with any book, where I could feel the authors had been within the landscapes and not seeing them for some thousand feet above. That happened some decades ago. That book had the name Dominic Davis on the cover. <laughs> it was a joyful relief. There was someone out there who did not see human diversities as rarities, who offered me not only knowledge, but also compassion. This book Pink Therapy, the first one in the series, was for me the first book I read with insights from an outside that I myself belonged to. I was, it was a profound and healing process, hence the names linked to that book has been in my treasure chest ever since. And here they are again. This is the mind field. Is sex and eroticism beside, beside the scope of therapy, be it psychological, medical, 
or in any other way aim to assist the improvement of clients' lives. You know, in 2018 and 2021, I was invited to give Norwegian doctors in psychiatry specialization a day of sexology. <laughs> <laughs> Altogether, there were 72 of them. My first question was, has any of you in your many years of education and training learned anything about sex and gender? One had had a two hours lecture, the rest, nothing. So my next question was, do any of you believe that sex and gender is of significance to men mental health? They all love it. <laughs> and I exclaimed, isn't it strange? This is, I fear, the state of therapeutic competence in this field in most corners of the globe. At places, it is much worse. Condemning fellow human beings to death or oblivion. Only in some sacred spots, it is better. Such a spot is your, in your hands right now. It is my thorough belief that this book will improve the knowledge and in consequence, the lives of many, <coughs> including your own. It, <clears throat> you must still step into the landscapes and still have numerous equal and loving talks with those people this book concerns. There are no shortcuts. Nevertheless, a detailed map like this will always come in handy. Thank you.